Did you remember in the previous videos we have discussed about IoT architecture? IoT architecture has four stages. The first stage consists of devices. Devices further consist of sensors and actuators. The function of the sensors is to collect data from its environment and send it to the internet. But what happens with that data after sending that data? I mean, where that data is stored or kept? Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I'm Dr. Zahar Ahmed. Having more than 20 years of teaching, learning and research experience. In this video, I'm going to share what is cloud and as a cloud, what we use in our Arduino projects so that finally you'll be able to do your all Arduino based project. So what is cloud? Cloud is a place where your data is stored. You may ask the question, you can store your data in your hard disk or in USB or in pen drive. Of course not, you can't do it because the, gen the data which is generated, it is very huge data, it's very large data. That is beyond the capacity of any hard disk or pen drive or USB. So, in modern technology, we have a place where we can send that data, store there, analyze, access data, and that is called cloud. Cloud are paid services. They are operated by Google, Amazon, Microsoft, Adobe. So when you are going to do any project in Arduino, then of course you are not going to pay so much money. Most of your system is almost free. Then why would you pay a lot of money? So what is the option you can choose? And the option is things speak. What is things speak? Things speak is IoT platform where one can send sensor data to the cloud. Is it clear? ThinkSpeak is a web service named REST API. Data can also analyze and visualize with MATLAB or other software, including making your own applications. The ThinkSpeak service is operated by MathWorks. So we will see how it works. ThinkSpeak, this is again a architecture, an architecture where things are connected, these are all sensor enabled things. This is the temperature sensor, this is the luminous sensor, LDR sensor, this temperature system, and this is a local display, this is LDA, and this is push button. This all data sent to the internet for further analysis. And accordingly, the data is analyzed, visualized, and action can be taken. So when this, uh, the sensors send their data with the help of your module and other protocols, that data is kept here. This is things is speak. Your data is stored here. Where you can analyze or access or visualize the data and can take action as per your requirement. This is simple as we are looking in this picture. There's no, not big deal. The thing is big service also perform online analysis and act on your data. This is only free for small non-commercial project. That is, you can do a small project or academic project on things is big. It works with Arduino, Raspberry Pi, and MATLAB ESP8266 and SP32 books. So how it works? What is thing is speak and how it works? We could see it. In the next, next video, we'll see how to install or how to work with 
things speak. Emma signing out until we meet again.